because this question wants us to explain how many protons, neutrons, electrons and aluminium ion has. So first of all, if we have a look on the periodic table, we find that the uh, mass and atomic number of aluminium is as shown here. But this means that as an atom, it has 13 protons. The bottom number is the number of protons. The difference between those two numbers is the number of neutrons. So 27 take away 13 is 14 neutrons. And because it's an atom, it has to have 13 electrons. Okay, that's the atom. Now the 13 electrons are arranged 2, 8, and then 3. This is not stable. So how is it going to become stable? What it's going to do is it's going to lose those three electrons. So they're going to be lost. That means that when you have the ion, it will still have 13 protons, 14 neutrons, but now it's only going to have 10 electrons. Okay, so there's your answer.